City of Hope held their annual 5K walk this Sunday in support of raising funds for women's cancer research. Over 11,000 people came. Festive hats, signs, and shirts were everywhere in support of those with cancer. City of Hope is the only hospital in the nation who runs a series of fundraisers which directly fund research for cancers unique to women. Thousands of women are walking around today with their purple boas to show that they've won their battle with cancer. With plenty of purple boas to go around, cupcakes and flowers too, City of Hope did all they could to make the survivors feel special. I think that means to them that they're a survivor and they see everybody else wearing one and they know there's a lot of survivors out there and, and it's wonderful to hear them say 21 years and 10 years and so it means a lot to us to see other women with these boas. People filled out post-its with messages of love and support for the cancer survivors. They were displayed on hope boards around the event. Nearly everyone who participated in the walk had been affected by cancer in some way. Um, I'm a cancer survivor and I also work at City of Hope and so we thought it was appropriate to believe in hope, you know, because we need a cure for all this stuff. This is a very special hat. Um, sadly, I've had to add ribbons to it. Each one is the name of a woman that I walk for that either um, lost her battle or is still fighting breast cancer. The Walk for Hope fundraiser used to only research breast cancer but has now expanded its research to all forms of cancer affecting women. Over $900,000 was raised. This is Jackie Grant, KUSC News.